Hey everyone, it's Mac with Minard's Leisure World and today we're going to be looking at a brand new 2018 product. This is the Wolf Pup 16 BHS. Brand new line for 2018. Let's talk about features. What are you getting with this trailer? Well, it's about a 20 foot long coach, weighs in at just over 3,000 pounds. So if you have a full size SUV, you can easily tow this anywhere you like to go. Some of the things I like about the trailer is that get up and go nature. It's like hauling your hotel room wherever you like. So looking at the front nose cap here, we do have a molded aluminum nose cap, very nice and thick, very durable and aerodynamic. They also give you some rock guard underneath here. You do get a single 20 pound propane tank to run your furnace, your cooktop, all that good stuff. On this side here, we do have a baggage compartment. Now I'm gonna go a little more in depth about this compartment once we're inside the trailer, but as you can see, nice large storage area Great accessibility right there. Up front, we also have the Furion pre-wire set for the solar panels. If you have the Furion system, it's plug and play. Stepping underneath the nice large awning. This guy runs almost the entire length of the trailer. I really enjoy that. It looks great, gives you lots of shade. We also have the LED light strip underneath. Great blue lighting accents, the blue lighted speakers underneath. Really, it's just a great looking trailer overall. I love these decals, how they stand out against the color of the trailer. We're also getting an LCD TV mount here, as well as all of your TV hookups. You've got a 110 volt outlet, as well as your coax hookups right there. So if you like to watch the game underneath your awning, you can absolutely do so. So what you're getting with this small little man door is some excellent storage space. When you open it up, it takes you right to the rear bunk area. And what you can actually do is fold this bunk right up flat to open up this entire area. You can fit bikes in there. You can fit really whatever you like. Now you can also secure that bunk up so it's not falling on top of your gear. Really nice feature as well. And of course, close it up. It's just like your entry door lock so you don't have extra keys and it locks up nice and tight. Before we step inside the trailer, I just want to talk about a couple more things here. First one being the sturdy step. This is a really great feature, something you don't see usually on trailers of this size. Now, I weigh almost 200 pounds, and this thing does not budge one bit. Normally, when I'm walking in and out of a trailer, it rocks the whole thing. That is not the case with the sturdy step. Second thing I'd like to point out, you do get a grab handle too. So if you're a little off balance, maybe after a night of sitting by the fire, that'll give you a nice hand as well. They also give you friction door hinges. Now, another premium feature that we're starting to see more and more on these smaller trailers, it's basically gonna hold the door wherever you leave it. It's not gonna blow shut on you. Let's go inside. All right, now we're inside the Wolf Pup. Looking at the front of the trailer, you'll see the master bed. Really impressive feature. This is a full size queen. That's right, you're not getting a short queen. You're not getting a narrow queen. It's a full size queen. This is a hypoallergenic mattress. It's also an upgraded mattress from the base that you normally get. Now, I was talking about that extra storage space outside, that cargo area. You can actually access it from inside the trailer just by simply lifting up the mattress. We do have gas shocks that hold that open for us. You can see the massive storage you get there. Now, what I like about this, you can have some folks outside piling stuff in while you're in here sorting it. Or if there's something you need quick access to, all you gotta do is lift the bed. And of course, it goes down nice and easy. Now, right beside the bed, we do get a small shelf, as well as a 110 outlet and a USB port. That's a really big feature here. USB ports galore, they are all over this trailer. Really nice and accessible from the dinette as well. This dinette does, of course, drop down into a bed and you do get some nice storage underneath just by lifting the seat. On this side of the trailer, we start to see our kitchen. We've got some standard cupboard doors, really nice aluminum rods here on the solid wood doors, stainless steel appliances, which are nice and easy to keep clean. We've got our microwave and our range hood. We do get a two burner cooktop that runs off of your single 20 pound propane bottle up front and a single bowl sink. So now we're starting to move towards the rear of the trailer. Before we do that, I'd just like to point out up in the ceiling here, this is your air distribution box for your 13,500 BTU air conditioner. You don't often see an AC of this size in this small of a trailer. 
So if you're camping in 40 above weather, this is gonna keep you really nice and cool. You usually see these guys on 30 foot plus trailers. Really great feature. Over here is our media center. You can control your speakers on the interior and exterior through this guy here. You can connect via Bluetooth, auxiliary cord, or a USB cable. Great stuff. On our bunks, you'll see we have our thermostat. You can control your furnace from there on those chilly nights. The bunks each have their own USB ports, so the kids won't be fighting over who gets to charge their electronics. And they give you this nice teddy bear mattress material. I know the kids really like that. We were talking before about that exterior hatch to uh, store all of your extra gear. You can see that here at the bottom bunk, just right there. With the bunk folded down, you'd never know it was there. Our fridge that we get here is a six cubic foot. Very unheard of for a trailer this size. Usually it's a small compact unit with an ice box. Now you're getting a separate freezer. Freeze up a lot of space for you. Let's take a look at the bathroom. So now that we're inside the bathroom, you'll see that you get a foot flush toilet. Really nice feature, keep your hands nice and clean, as well as a small shower. What they do to increase the size in the shower is they radius out the rail for that shower curtain. So for taller guys, bigger guys like me, it makes it a little more comfortable inside. You also do get a roof vent with a 12 volt fan. Really nice to see as well. Now we've taken a look at the Wolf Pup 16 BHS. I hope you enjoyed looking at it. Some things to remember. We've got excellent storage capacities in this trailer. We can access it from underneath the bed or from outside and store stuff underneath the bunks. We have a full-sized master bed. This is a full-sized queen and it is an upgraded mattress. A little nicer than what you normally get. We've got LED lighting throughout. Keeps the heat down, keeps the power usage down. We've also got stainless steel appliances and a really nice big fridge. Now, these small trailers I love for pack up and go. This is a much nicer unit than you usually get in this size. I think it's one of those ones that you really have to come down and see. So come see us at Minards and we'll show you what we got.